hey y'all welcome back to my channel currently headed into work y'all and i wanted to get on here and do a quick little video um judging by the title that's the reason why you're here and i i have something to say about strong mommy chrissy i don't normally talk about her and it's not about to be a real bashing session like that because i you know I don't I just don't talk about her I like her yes um, I watch her content or whatnot you know everybody seen um, her life uh, of course through the YouTube streets when you know every situation that she went through through the YouTube streets um, her last uh, situation through the YouTube streets and that situation turned out not to be the best for her, right? Hmm. She, it's a document floating around. How people get this stuff? Well, no, let me take that back because it do be pub public record. Um, I don't know how much of the public gets to see what they what you see. Do you do you have to be a part of the the, the courts to see? What, is, what has been put out there, I, I do not know. But it's, it's out there, right? Seen the documentation talking about Chrissy's ex-boyfriend, ex-fiance, um, who she's no longer with, you know, saying some, some pretty bad things um, that he, he would supposedly have done to her, right? that's bad it's bad within itself but what makes the matters worse is that when all of this was floating around um before <sighs> y'all i always say somebody don't have to get on here and tell their business they don't have to do that that's something that they don't have to do um, they don't have to sit there and tell her, oh, yeah, you might have seen the documentation. Let me go ahead and speak on it. That's an embarrassing situation. If this has truly happened to her, um, this, this that's embarrassment for her. Like, anybody that has gotten, you know, got uh, gotten abused, domestic violence, you had that stuff. You had it to the point of where you don't want nobody to know what sh what's going on, what you got going on. Or nothing. You lie. You lie. Knowing that when you go home, you getting knocked against the daggone wall. Why I say that? Because I've been there. I've been there. I've been to that point to where I would get abused and I would lie. Well, how did you get that bruise? Oh, no, I failed. But everybody knew leave him alone oh no he's good for me he's the best everybody lies when it comes to domestic violence you don't want nobody to know the truth you don't want nobody to say anything bad about that person you lie and that's exactly what she has done she's lied she's lied um to protect him because that's what you you, you do for your abuser um you, you, you lie to protect them until you can't any longer. So she is going through this. Will she come out and, and clear it all up and say, yeah, y'all, it was me. This is why I'm not together with him. This, that, and the third. Will she come out and say that's the, that's the whole question now. Will she come out and, and tell it? Or will she continue to be in the dark because she already have other situations going on as far as her living situation? And, you know, I think we all kind of fail to realize that they don't have to come out here and, and share anything. They choose to share what they share. When you, but, you know, certain things you be wanting somebody to say something about, but they never do. They tell it in their own time. And I get that. I get the fact that, you know, maybe she don't want to come out and say anything because she is highly embarrassed. That's why she she didn't 
she said, oh, this is not the reason why we broke up. He just needs to work through some things. And his anger issues is what he needs to work with. Yeah, she, she loved him. Hell, I loved him too. You know? But I was still getting beat, beat up. You know what I mean? Domestic violence is not okay. Even when it's coming from, you know, the female getting beat on or the male getting beat on. Domestic violence is never okay. You know, you should never be okay with just, you know, whatever. Never. And I think the reason why she she got out of that situation is because it was put it was put out. It was put out. You know, for the world to see that she's been abused. You know, she um she uh it is, she's embarrassed and she don't want to stick beside him or did she really let him go you know what I mean y'all I mean it could be to the point to where he's not in the camera's view anymore you know what I mean so I mean people you know you, you, you love your abuser you don't want to let go of your abuser until you have to let go of your abuser and that seemed like that was a situation for her she didn't want to let him go but to save her and her and her kids sake that could be the reason why she has to up and, and leave and move again maybe she talked about breaking her lease i don't know y'all we don't know what the situation is why she why she was um had to go to court or whatnot um that's a whole nother scenario but the domestic violence y'all she i i've been there to where she the reason why you lie to cover up the truth until you can no longer deal with it you know luckily I got out of that situation you know um and never look back never look back it's been so many years ago if I if I would have you know if I'd have known what I you know know now I wouldn't have let it go down like that but it did it was unfortunate it, it happened um but I know I know I know better now you know what I'm saying? I know better now. I I don't do I wish her the best. I wish I wish her the best. Uh if she needs to get counseling, which I think she probably needs to get counseling. Um cuz that's a that was a, that could be very traumatic for her. For any any woman that goes through that. You don't want to continue getting beat on, you know, even though she, you know, she's saying that she's not with him, you know. And she wants to get away because that could, if he's, if he's always, well, according to the doc, court documents, <laughs> he's always been, you know, a little violent. So, y'all, I, 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 yeah, that's, that's a sad situation right there. Um, wait a minute. Luckily, she, she did walk away from that you know with her life because it, a lot of people don't survive domestic violence I walked away with my life a lot of people do not survive domestic violence you know now it's it's all on her to either come out and clear the situation up or continue to keep quiet because she don't have to tell her story we can all speculate and 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 call her a liar all day long but she don't have to come out and tell her story because she's embarrassed Y'all, I'm done. I'm done. It's not a lot I want to speak on the situation. So I am done. Um, if you have anything to say, leave me some comments down below. Um, yeah. Um, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed, y'all go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And until next time.